Hi everybody and welcome back to my lab. Uh, today I have for you a tip on Proteus. Uh, the problem that I ran into today, to today is uh, trying to uh, get my graphics uh, for, to fit onto my onto my layer. Uh, one of the things that you'll find is as the packages start to get smaller and smaller, uh, things like the the labels for the parts uh, become impossible to fit. And so today I want to give you a quick little demonstration on how to how to change the font size for all of your labels okay uh, and if you are a fan of these shorter videos the sort of the how to please uh, give it a thumbs up make comments down below uh, if you don't like it uh, constructive criticism is always appreciated uh, you can feel free to give it a thumbs down and uh, yeah do subscribe if you like this content all right <laughs> Okay, so here we are. I have a fictitious design, and this is uh, an, an SOC package. This is uh, probably uh, the biggest that you're going to get these days uh, for SMT parts. And as you can see, I've I've put some resistors and uh, capacitor on here. This this one is an 0604. Uh, these ones I believe were 0805. Is what I put on here. Uh, these are 0603, even better. Uh, and I, I also have thrown some some just spare parts on here to, to show you sort of where all this came from. And so here we have a through hole part. And back back in the back in the day when we did a lot of through hole stuff, uh, these labels were great. As a matter of fact, you could even hide the label underneath the part. So when you were doing assembly, you could see it. Afterwards, you didn't really care. And you could start to you could start to get parts in fairly close. Now, fast forward to today, almost everything is a surface mount or SMT, and here we have a capacitor. This is kind of a standard size capacitor, and you can see that uh, it it fits the the label fits quite nicely, and so we wouldn't have to worry about it too awfully much for this. Uh, but as the as our parts start to get smaller, you can see uh, 1206, uh, 0603 and then down to all the way to uh, 0402 uh, it starts to get packed in a little bit tight and you know is, is this acceptable yeah yeah you know you could probably get away with this but it looks really cluttered it looks really chunky and so a uh, couple things the first one is I want to I want to uh, I want to make sure that all my resistors are lined up in this case and so uh, if I if I go uh, highlight them all and I go to the tools menu, I can use the align tool, which is control A. Uh, we can uh, center all of the parts. In this case, I'm going to align the right hand side of all these parts and it nicely lines them all up. This would mean that I could I could then lay my traces in nice and clean like so. Um, and this is just this is just a pet pet uh, thing that I like. So now to the point at hand, this looks cluttered. I want to reduce the size of all of my um, of of my labels. And so what I could do is go in if there was just one that I wanted to change, I I could go in and and change the 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 height and the width of it. Um, but I can't I can't change too too much else other than that. But what I can do is go under technology, then I can go to uh, set text style, and in here I can change this, uh, let's say to, let's go half the size, so 30 thousandths of an inch by 25 thousandths of an inch, and we'll do that for everything. 30, and 25 and I'll also change the the uh, line weight down to five thousandths of an inch and we'll change this too we we, we don't have any uh, here um, but incidentally if you ever wanted to show the part values we could turn this on as well and so here you can see now see uh, that it will actually give us labels so uh, it, when you're doing prototypes uh, this becomes really really handy for example, now that I have a smaller part, I can actually 
uh, grab that label and everything can fit in here nicely okay or we can go back and turn that back off uh, technology textile and we'll turn that off and you can see that these can get in a lot tighter a lot closer and they look a lot neater when we when we uh, when we do our, our layout here we go and we'll go look at our 3d view and you can see that those lay in there quite nicely and we have lots of room around it all right uh, very short very sweet simple to the point i hope you liked it uh, give it a thumbs up if you do uh, if not you know i understand and you can absolutely hit the thumbs down but do subscribe if you'd like to support my channel all right thanks and have yourself a great day bye now